Hey guys, welcome to Craze of Style Learners. Hope you are all safe and how is your quarantine? If you see our video in first time, please like, share and comment and don't forget to subscribe. So, are you ready to travel with me to know some mysteries about physics? Come, let's get started. First one, dark matter, planets, stars, Asteroids, galaxies, the things that we can actually see make up less than 5% of the total universe. Scientists think another 25% is a strange substance called dark matter. We can't see it, we don't understand it, but we are pretty sure it's out there because everything moves to its gravitational tune. Scientists believe that dark matter acts like a spider's web holding force moving galaxies together and that's so much of the stuff that it bends the appearance of space so that when astronomers observe distant galaxies they often appear distorted. We have plenty of evidence that dark matter exists but as for what it is that what remains mystery. Some think dark matter is composed of an undiscovered particles and others believe it is an undiscovered property of a gravity. Whatever the truth, dark matter is a real puzzle and it's proved hugely tricky to pin down. And second one, dark energy. So, if dark matter makes up 25% of the universe and the normal matter makes up 5%, what about other 70%? We think that the remainder is entirely dark energy powerful enough to tear the entire universe asunder. Whereas it dark matter appears to miss galaxies together, dark energy seems to want to push everything apart. We all know that universe is expanding but it's expanding more and more quickly than it should be and scientists think that dark energy is a culprit. But where's dark energy coming from? Some believe that it's produced from collisions between quantum particles, but no one knows for sure. And third one, antimatter. Imagine yourself in opposite land, black is white, up is down, and matter is antimatter. It sounds like crazy, na? But the subatomic particles that make up everything around us, electrons, protons, and neutrons, all have evil twins. Antimatter particles are the same mass as normal particles but the opposite electric charge. And because of this, antimatter wipes out normal matter on contact. Poof. Both are destroyed in an instant. So, antimatter has the potential to destroy us and everything we love. But fear not, there's very little antimatter roaming around in the cosmos. Okay guys, hope you all well understand. We we'll see you in next part two video. If you have any doubt or you want any topics, please comment. And thanks for watching and once again like, share and comment and subscribe our channel. We will see you in next video guys. Bye.